limited time offer. Get that awesome gaming gear combo not for $129.99 but for $69.99. Yes, only $69.99. Wow, unbelievable. Hey, what's up, GG? Quibla's back today to play Top Mommy, the QQ Master. Here are the runes, masteries, skill distribution, and items that you need to climb the ladder and a flash. In the laning phase, you will have no problem to harass the Fakabish that tries to kill you because her damage is nothing compared to yours. That's right, this mini mommy is so tanky that you can easily scare your opponent with a QQ River headbutt combo no matter what champion he's playing. However, the best moment to piss off your victim is when there's a bunch of minions around you because you'll be able to use your headbutt skill all day long without taking any substantial damage. And when you finally obtain your Sunfire Cape, you can be sure that Mundo will not cry when he pleases. Thanks to your QQ Reaver headbutt combo, beating the enemy army like a superhero to let your own army siege a tower will be a piece of cake. If you ever get gang, you don't have to fret about it because you'll be a super mega ultra unbelievably tanky mother bitch even at the early stage of the game. So just then they walk until you reach your tower and these guys will give up on sending you back to your coffin. Look at this, how can they expect to kill you with a freaking surfboard and a cheap wooden stick from the dollar store? That's just unbelievable! If a sexy lady tries to kill you, do a headbutt QQ River spiderweb combo. Follow up with a spider mine headbutt combo and follow her like a loyal, lo lo yolo, loyal dog until she gives you her pocket change. The best way to bring down an enemy is to spam your QQ River headbutt combo until his health is low enough to finish him off with an ignite spider mine spiderweb combo. But you must remember that you're not a stupid burst master champion, so a duel can be as long as a Dragon Ball fight if you're fighting against another tanky champion. But you can be sure that the one that will come out of top will always be you, the crying master. However, if your opponent is a funny little squish baby boy, you can take your time to destroy the turret while he tries to smash you, and when you're done with your first job, just do the same thing as usual to show him who's the big boss and the family. The cool thing with Amumu is that you can easily follow the lead of your jungler to get the easiest kill of your life. And then, since you have some free time on your hand, you can wander and the enemy's jungle to find Donkey Kong and steal his two bananas that he just ate. Thanks to this beautiful mask, you'll be able to burn and burn and burn a pretty girl until she's tanned like karma, or barbecue this pig on a board until she's cooked to perfection. k k k counter jungle In teamfights, no one can escape from this murderous mummy because he will always, always, and always come back at you to wreck the low lives of this world. No matter what the opposite team tries to do, he will hunt them until they draw their last breath. But your true role isn't to greedily take every kill for yourself. It is to use your wonderful stuns and your small body to protect your carries that always cry because no one peels for them. Even if you die, you will rise from the dead once again if you have this item to help your teammates become the number one player and their family. A good way to surprise your victims is to pretend to chase the wannabe dragon, then turn back and flash spider mind combo these two poor little guys for two easy kills. After that, continue what you did with Shitvana to raise the moral of Jinx the Crazy Baby. Peanut damage! Even more peanut damage! Surprise, motherfucker! That's it for today, people! Don't forget to check out my channel for more boring League of Legends video. Feel free to leave a comment in any language you want, but I'll only answer those in English and in French because I'm a racist fuckabish! Ciao soon!